Okay, howdy folks. I'm cleaning out that injector that was plugged up on the old Toyota 4x4 and how I did it was online I seen a guy make this system up out of an old valve stem, a tire valve stem, rubber, and then it just hooks up to the cap. You take out the valve stem and uh, you got the rubber part from the, the tire, you know. You got a rubber valve stem there. You just take out the inside and pull out the rubber part and it fits over top of the injector. You hook it up to your carb cleaner, pressure it up. Then you gotta have power source like a battery charger or whatever and there you go. You do it a few times, power her up again, pressure her up, hit her. Once she starts running clean and good, she's good to go. So I'm gonna do that to all of them. This one was really plugged up, but I didn't know if it was gonna work anymore. Now, if I had, you know, lots of money to spend, I'd probably just get all new injectors, but I don't, so that's how I'm cleaning her out. So that's a, this tool is good to do. There was a guy online that made one, and I copied his idea, and it works like a hot damn, so and that's it. all these are just little electrical connectors from, you know, those blue ones. I just cut them so they fit inside here. And, uh, yeah, they work great. So, you know, this injector I'm going to use again. Um, the other question is, why did it get so gunked up like that, you know? But, oh well. I get this Toyota back up and hop and hope this helps some other people out that can't get it to run or run right or low power or idle proper. Or, you know, I went through, through this truck over and over and over and yeah, it takes time. So I'll clean up these injectors. Like, like I said, this one is just completely plugged. If you look in there, look at that. Look at the end of that. That's supposed to be completely clear. It's so corroded up with stuff, it's unbelievable. So that's the problem. That's why she wasn't even opening up. She's not getting any fuel to that cylinder, so. Or very little, so it wouldn't run on that, so. Alrighty, alrighty folks. Take care and see you on the flip side here. And this thing's up and running, hopefully. This will be my new ice fishing rig. <laughs> Check out my website, www.ratsleds.com and that's how you clean an injector. So yeah, it works pretty good. I'll do that to all of them now and get her back together.